my world now. Ain't no chance it'll end up different now. This shit is happening. I don't look as good as before. The shit burns, but <laughs> at least I ain't going to prison. I've never seen such chaos. This new world order. I like it. Normally I ain't the type to keep a damn journal, but something this big? Worth documenting for sure. Shit's about to get crazy. I met my first survivor. He looked like a shitty weak man. Holding some dead whore in his arms. Ain't much left for her to do round here. He begged for help like a bitch, so I killed him. Sid Bailey, at your service. You're welcome. I've been high on Psycho for days. It's wearing off and I'm damn hungry. I'd kill for a steak. I'd even kill without one. Searching the streets, I met another poor soul. She seemed to be lost. So I comforted her and talked some shit to make her feel better. When she turned her back, I split her head with a stone. Where are the fucking police now? <laughs> when I saw her body laying splayed out on the road, I felt the temptation. Not like all those other girls before. It was different. I wanted to fucking bite her and eat. So I did. This new freedom. To do whatever the fuck I want. It's amazing. No more eating out of trash cans. People taste just fine. <laughs> Today I went back to the place where I hit that chick. But she wasn't there no more. Only thing left was a trail of blood leading towards some buildings. Damn, she tasted good. I bet even better cooked. I don't think them infected care much for dragging bodies into buildings before they eat, but I don't know. Most likely I ain't alone. Someone else must have found out how good people taste too. Better than starving for sure. I'm going to kill that motherfucker who stole my dinner. And if it ain't one of them infected types, then I'm going to cook them up and eat them. I'll follow the blood trail. Let's see who's stronger. Well, turns out I was the stronger one. Some bitch came out the front door as I got close and invited me inside. When she turned away, I took her by the throat. Tried to be quiet in case others were inside, but the bitch pulled a knife and managed to cut my leg before she went limp. The cut ain't too bad. Tied a bit of a rag round it. It'll stop bleeding soon. I checked around inside. Seems empty, of humans anyway. Seems she got a couple of those infected ones locked in a room upstairs. I can hear them through the door. What the fuck was this bitch up to? Fuck it, they can stay there. Make good guard dogs, I guess. There's a few other locked doors I can't get into, but one room is vacant for rent. Huh. Has a nice old style cast iron bathtub. I bet it would make an excellent stew pot if I build a fire under it. Time to drag that bitch in here. But first, I'm going to have a hit of Psycho. Because why not, right? <laughs> Any more I come across, this will be the place I bring them.